well? Perfect. Mom, Dad, no, he won't burn the house down with you in it. You might, but you might want to lock up the good silver or any family heirlooms that might be lying around. Back up! We have family heirlooms? <laughs> <laughs> Just what are you planning to tell my parents? Nothing? <sighs> Jesus, Gabby, you know, I'm not you. You know, I really wish you and Mom and Dad and the rest of the world would get that through your dense heads. <gasps> I think you mean <sighs> You know, I think I lost my appetite. I really thought I could, actually, but no. Glad we could not do this. Hey, you just gotta, yo, you can't leave. I reserved this place months ago. We haven't even looked at the menu. It's our birthday. Oh, and you haven't even opened your gift. Oh, Christ, the gift. Didn't get a chance to get you one. Oh, got you covered. Oh, <laughs> that better be costume. Oh, you owe me 200. Dollars for costume? You have to pay extra to make it look real. Is it really gorgeous? <laughs> yeah, gorgeous. Uh, add it to my tab. I need an accountant to keep tabs on your tab. By the way, Snooky from the Jersey Shore called and she'd like her check suit back. <laughs> <laughs> I feel sexier when I'm comfortable. Feeling sexy is not the same as being sexy. Anyway, when you finish the book, you'll be loaded. And you'll hire my firm, right, Dad? I'll be your publicist and go on the book tour. My schedule's quite open, but you can find me. Okay, let's not get ahead of ourselves here, okay? Your firm? You still work for yourself by yourself. <laughs> Besides, I don't think there's going to be a whole thing. Actually, that's what I wanted to talk to you about. That's how you. it works. You'll, you'll need your own team to push the book. Well, who better than your twin sister? Oh, and podcasts are everything right now. I should really start researching those pronto. Excuse me. Hey, Siri, remind me to listen to more book podcasts. <laughs> Book podcasts. <laughs> book. <laughs> book. Pod. Remind me to. Oh, perfect. Oh. No, no. Thank you, Siri. That would be all. <laughs> Yo, Miranda Priestley, everyone with an iPhone has a Siri. She's a bitch. Oh. <laughs> you are so not technical. That's why you need me. You know, if I could write like you, I could J.K. Rowling run for her money. Yeah, because everything you touch turns to gold. And everything I touch turns to... <laughs> hey, Siri, what's a fancy word for shit? <laughs> 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 so, about the tour, I could really get away. The farther the better. Do you think we'll start New York? Ooh, or better yet, California. Charles won't be home tonight for my birthday dinner. Work. See, Charlie boy, that's what I mean. College soulmate, Fifty Shades of Gorgeous. Killer job, actually sweet. I mean, he's a fucking unicorn. How are you gonna lock that down? It's been like forever. What? Look, engagements are very sure. Nine years is definitely not a douche. It's <laughs> more like a due decade. But no one says that. People are going to start to wonder if you're his beard. Charles doesn't have a beard. <laughs> no, I mean, like, maybe he's on the down low. <laughs> on the down low? <laughs> you make Charles sound like a, a drug dealer. A member of uh, the Crisps of the Bloods. <laughs> crisps? It's Crips, <laughs> God, you are like the definition of unhip. Oh, hip people don't use the word hip. They say, they say something else. Hip to you is where your pelvis meets your upper thigh. How did you know what they say, LOL? Laugh out loud. Little old lady. <laughs> <laughs> it's all downhill now that your college reunions are double digits. So are yours. I never finished, so I don't have college reunions. <laughs> what has got you so worked up? God, it's just a number. You look the same as you did yesterday. Yeah, awful. I didn't say that. <laughs> All right, where's that fucking waiter? I mean, is it a requirement in these fancy restaurants to have shitty service? I need a cocktail ASAP. 
one for each hand, one for each of my nerves. Barely noon. And nothing. I just thought we were going to do that cleanse. You know, no alcohol, no sugar, no grains. No, no fun. Yeah, no. <laughs> <laughs> thought about it for a nanosecond, but no, 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 thank you. Not for me. <laughs> Not for me. God, you always say that. We were supposed to do it together, Gabby. That was the point. You're pushing 40. Uh, we're pushing 40. Then why do you think we're only three minutes apart and we look like we're, like we could be, <gasps> you know what? <laughs> never mind. No, never mind. Say it. <laughs> Say it. Say it. Blow your voice. Say it or I'm going to fucking walk out of here. Shut up. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Gabrielle, you're so dramatic. Save it for your novel. Don't. You leave my writing out of this. You can't get a divorce at 30 and just give up on life. Okay, it's been a decade since March. Don't, don't you even say his name. He is fucking Voldemort. <laughs> <laughs> his name is a four letter word and the only curse word I never ever want to hear again. You could say any other one, shit, damn, fuck, okay, okay. I don't care, okay. okay. You made your point. She was just, you're so distant. We used to be the keeper of each other's secrets. And nothing, nothing good and nothing bad was ever really real until I told it to you at the end of the day. Oh. You want real? <laughs> There's not going to be a book tour because I can't write the book. I uh, had to return the advance, so it's over for real. For real, for real. Like, my agent dropped me. I drained all of my accounts, and uh, yesterday I filed for unemployment again. Again, again. <laughs> you know, I was even thinking of selling my eggs. Do you know that you can get between 15 grand all the way up to 100? <laughs> but I guess I am too old to be a desirable candidate. Apparently, it's only 33 of geriatric, so I guess mine are uh, prehistoric. <laughs> I can't even give them away if I want to. Wait, wait. No book? No book tour? Oh my god. I'm sorry, did you hear me? I said we had rotten eggs. Why? <laughs> oh, you really screwed things up this time for the both of us. <laughs> this isn't about you! Oh! I knew it. I knew you couldn't do it. I knew you couldn't just. Listen without judging me. You just couldn't resist being the good one, the no. right one, the successful no, 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 one, no, no, the pretty no, 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 one. No, 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 no. Your life or lack of a life is not my fault. Oh, I never said it was. Yeah. So whose fault is it? It is what it is. <laughs> it is what it is until you take some fucking responsibility for yourself, your actions, and inactions. Selena said a bad word. You said fucking. <coughs> okay, you, you're, you're unemployed. <laughs> you basically have no money, no prospects. And on top of that, you're taking booty calls from the freak on the second floor who climbed up the fire escape and broke into your apartment. Like he took anything of real value. But he still had your laptop. It was a piece of shit that kept freezing up on me. I mean, no wonder I couldn't write the book. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, you are hopeless, hopeless. And he fixed it and brought it back. So you know, he really is basically a morally questionable nerd slash genius. Uh, was he cute at least? Oh, are you kidding me? He's so not cute. <laughs> <laughs> he is super hot. Like mega, mega hot. Wow! Ah, <laughs> oh. uh -huh. oh, yeah. You just don't think possibly hot burglar boy could possibly be into flabby gabby. No, no, I didn't say that. It, it's just, is he asking you not to press charges for the break-in? I mean, you said it hadn't gone to court yet. Oh my God! You officially suck. <laughs> this is the one good thing that has happened to me in a year of shit. You know what? 
excuse me. I'm gonna go see if Hot Burglar Boy wants to play. No, don't. Oh, I'm a grown ass woman. I'm no, do what I want. Yeah, I know, I know. I mean, don't go. Why the fuck should I stay? I'm gonna leave by myself. Oh, <coughs> not good enough, sister. I I don't want to spend our birthday alone. And I think. God, I think Charles might. Ugh, I can't understand you when you're mumbling. I said I think Charles is seeing someone. You think or you, you know? No. <laughs> I think I know. That's why I needed this tour. Oh. I've had this strange prickling on my scalp like the top of my head was just a little bit on fire, you know, when he called to say he had to work late, again. When he kept forgetting to call to say he made it to his hotel. When he's home, but he's not really home. Come on, Charles has always had a one-track mind when he came to work. That does not uh, mean And I think I may or may not have been snooping. Oh. For presents, for our anniversary and my birthday. I may or may not have found something. But you found something? A note. Signed X O E. X O E. <laughs> Carla, what the fuck does that mean? Oh. X O, comma, E. Just E, like in case someone saw. But like a gnome de plume? Yeah, it was on one of those thick cards you get with fancy gifts. The timepieces and cufflinks and fountain pens. Come on, that's not really a smoky gun. It's been six months since, and before that, eight. So basically over a year. I, I felt like my hymen grew back. That was a version again, and not just physically. I started worrying about things I, I don't know if I ever worry about. Like what? How my boobs look, my thighs jiggling. <laughs> Do I still smell sweet down there? Uh, all right, how many boobs and thighs in there? <laughs> <laughs> Charles used to say that I smell like vanilla down there. I'm not that chemical car freshener vanilla. The good kind, like the frosting on top of Pop-Tarts. <laughs> you don't? A vanilla vagina. <laughs> Yeah. 
kind of became part of how I saw myself. Like, I must be doing okay because Gabby thinks I'm doing great. It feels like I've been jealous of you forever. Oh, ever since that time you, Sam, and I played hooky down by the beach, and I got stung by all those jellyfish. Well, you got the guy and I got all the bites. <laughs> Who gets stung three different times in one day? Me. <laughs> Did you retreat? No. You went back in. <laughs> you went in deeper. I mean, you always say that I convince you to go back in, but my God, have you met you? <laughs> no. You had the courage to think that this time would be different. That you'd be okay. Like the hero in one of your stories. That bad luck you say you have. It's your strength, Gabby. It's made you a fighter. Oh, aunt, I don't know what to say. Well, I know what you're going to do. You'll Marie Kondo your apartment. <laughs> what? You'll make some room. Get rid of anything you don't need and, and, and doesn't give you joy. Maybe huh. make some money, too. <laughs> and since you'll have more space, I'll come stay with you. Help out with the rent. <laughs> You'll write again, or find something else to be passionate about. Who am I kidding? Charles has always supported me. I don't even know who I am without him. Never let him know. And you know, if you're not sure about Charles yet, you could do the obvious thing. You could ask him. I don't have the words. I can help you. You would. Ah, oh, come on, what's a twin sister slash failed writer for? <laughs> what if this isn't failure? Just the, the push we need to get where we're going. Like, maybe, you know, we were born with our soulmates. Literally. Are you saying you want to be my soulmate, Cece? All I'm saying is, when you die, I won't let the cat eat your face. <laughs> and if I go first, you won't let you won't let the cat eat mine either. Are you getting a cat, or is this my cat? Wait, you hate cats. <laughs> okay, okay, I'll be your person too. Deal, pop cheeks.